uh, in this video I will show that uh, the transformation inverse transformation W equal to 1 over Z transforms circles or straight lines into circles or straight lines okay and we already uh, we have noticed that uh, for if Z equal to X plus I Y and in the W plane if the real part and imaginary parts are U and V then we have seen that um, and the X is nothing but u e square plus v square and y equal to minus v e square plus v square okay so we have seen this now you consider uh, an equation like this plus bx plus cy plus d equal to zero mm, so you see that under certain conditions uh, uh, this this represents a circle general circle or straight line if a is not equal to 0 then uh, this becomes straight lines and uh, under certain conditions on bcd and here if a equal to 0 so this is straight lines in and if a is not equal to 0 then it represents a circle okay so uh, under certain conditions so how can you decide so you can see that if a is not equal to 0 uh, if a is not equal to 0 uh, then I can I can write this as x square plus y square plus b by a x plus c by a y plus d by a equal to 0 and we can complete the squares actually x and here because it is it is uh, b by a so I need two times of that so therefore I have what b by twice a whole square i complete the square having x square etc and similarly i complete the square so if i uh, complete the square then you will see that this is c by twice a whole square and that is equal to so what are the extra things i have added so it is b square by 4 a square and plus c square by 4 a square and this d by a comes to the side d by a okay so i can say that this is twice a 4 a 4 a so uh, so you'll see that this is b square plus c square minus 4 a d square root of this and whole square okay so so you notice that so if b square plus c square is greater than 4 a d is greater than 4ad then this represents a what this is a square real square all right positive square <coughs> excuse me so if this uh, then um, our a x square plus y square plus bx plus cy plus d equal to 0 represents represents a circle. circle okay now we will use the transformation x equal to this and this so if you put here so uh, we have if we transform so these have been obtained from this inverse transformation so if I put those here x and y is there, then you, you, you can easily see that we have so a so x square plus u square so it is u square u square plus v square v square so this is your x square and this is v square e square plus v square whole square so this a x square and plus bx so b u u square plus v square plus c v minus u square plus v square and plus d equal to 0 so if you simplify so you'll see that this is d will be u square plus v square and plus b u and from here it will be minus c v and u square plus v square that uh, cancel out so we are left out with plus a only okay so plus a only so this is 0 so therefore our a this equation this equation is transformed to this equation okay so now here uh, 
you see that if d is not equal to 0, if d is not equal to 0, and uh, uh, this condition is already satisfied, all right? So therefore, you will see that uh, this will represent a circle, okay? And if d equal to 0, then is, this will represent straight lines, this straight lines, okay? So therefore, uh, depending upon a and d, a and d, whether they are positive, uh, whether they are zero or non-zero, so there will be four cases uh, where the circles and straight lines are transformed into circles and straight lines. Okay. So for what is the first case? First case is that uh, a is not equal to zero, okay, and d equal to zero. A is not equal to zero, d equal to zero. So these are the original equation. This is the original equation bx plus cy plus d equal to 0. And what is the transform equation? Transform equation is e square plus b square plus bu minus cv plus a equal to 0. So therefore, in the first case, this is case 1, case 1, so a is not equal to 0. a is not equal to 0 means this is a circle. So circle and d equal to what? d equal to 0. So if d equal to 0, if d equal to 0, then you see that uh, this, uh, this, this is a circle, this circle transforms through because d equal to 0, so this will be 0. So therefore, what, what is left out? So d, this will be left out, b u plus c minus c b plus a. So therefore, your circle becomes what? A straight line, straight line. So this becomes a straight line. And if d equal to 0, then this circle passes through what? this circle passes to 0 okay because when x and y are 0 0 so this is nothing but 0 that is satisfied so therefore uh, uh, this circle passes through 0 so a circle passing through passing through 0 passing through the origin passing to the origin becomes what a straight line because this is a straight line this is 0 but this is straight line because a is not 0, so this doesn't pass through 0, 0 in the w plane. So it is a, a straight line not passing through, not passing through the origin, through the origin, through the origin. Okay, so the circle passing through the origin becomes what? A straight line not passing through the origin under the transformation, this one. Okay, so that is the first case. And second case, what is the second case? The second case, you see that uh, your a is not equal to 0 and d is not, not equal to 0. Okay. So here, a is not equal to 0, d is also not equal to 0. So therefore, this is a circle not passing through the origin. And this is what? A circle not passing through the origin. This also doesn't pass through the origin. Okay. So a circle circle not passing not passing through through zero zero this becomes what in the w plane this is also a circle not passing through zero zero so this is the case two and what is case three that you can easily uh, easily check and what is your case four because these are the all four possible cases what is case, this one so this you can say for a equal to 0 and d is not equal to 0 and what is case 4? Case 4 is a is equal to 0 and d is also 0. So if a equal to 0 and d is not equal to 0 then you see that here a is 0 and d is not 0. So a straight line not passing through the origin becomes what? a 0 and d 0. Sorry. Uh, a0, A0 and D0, so it is a circle passing through the origin, straight line, straight line not, so a straight line not passing through, passing through 0, 0, okay, so this becomes, this becomes what, uh, a circle, a circle, a circle passing through the origin, passing through the origin, passing through the origin, 
okay so this is your case three similarly you can uh, write what is case four so i leave it to you to complete this case four what is case four okay so we have seen that under the transformation one w equal to one by z uh, the circles and straight lines are transformed into circles and straight lines because these are the only four cases okay thank you